Hey everyone, welcome back. Uh, here a while back, you may have seen this video. I posted up a review of the uh, V3 Stingray holster from Klinger. I had uh, originally done the unboxing or unbagging video, as it were, and then I tried it for a while and then uh, posted up a video with my honest uh, thoughts and opinions on the holster. Great holster, not the most comfortable, at least not for me, and uh, that doesn't mean that it's not a good holster, it's an excellent product, but it was not uh, destined to be my everyday carry. And apparently, Klinger must have seen that video, because they contacted me out of the blue. I did not know that the email was coming, but they reached out to me and wanted me to uh, try out a new product that they are offering. And so they did send this to me. Uh, on their dime, I, I have not paid for this product, and I just wanted to show you what it is. I will give it another good, honest uh, test period, then come back at a different time and uh, let you know what I think about it. So, here is the package from Cleaner Holsters, Van Buren, Arkansas. So, let's see what we have in the packaging. All right, so a little bit of Klinger swag. They apparently put this in all of their uh, all of their products because I got, I think, the same two stickers when I bought the holster. Uh, I have opened this and redacted my name and address. So uh, that's what they sent me, the Klinger cushion, and it's for the holster that fits my shield. So let's move that off to the side. And then I was expecting one of these, but they gave me... A pair of them so we're gonna set one off to the side and the cool thing about this is it actually is supposed to work on all of the holsters uh, not just the ones from from Klinger so let's open this up and get it out of this terrible cellophane package so that you don't have to look through the glare to see what comes in here all right get that out of the way all right, we've got some sticky dots, uh, Velcro branded even, so we know these are going to be good. A uh, little alcohol wipe, and then the cushion, um, along with a nice glossy uh, card with their logo on it. Follow them any of the places on social media, their email, uh, their address, their website, and of course, how to install it. It, it gave us the instructions, so we'll put that right over there good velcro lay that velcro side up for now uh now let us grab a holster so first off let's let's make that safe all right here recently somebody commented on one of my videos wanting to know why everybody posts up videos showing themselves uh clearing their gun or making sure that it's clear um when clearly they, uh, they're they not going to shoot anybody that's watching the video, or you should already know if the gun is clear. Uh, the answer that I have to that is I just, uh, I, I know whether my gun has uh, been cleared or not, but it's the unloaded guns that are the most dangerous. And so I always like to show that I, I have checked my firearm and cleared it on the camera. Uh, if anything, it's an example. Uh, just so that people that are watching this that maybe don't have as much firearm experience can uh, can see that that's what you need to do every time assumptions will get you killed or at least hurt or cause some other problem that you do not want to have to deal with so never assume that a gun is empty always assume that it's loaded until you have proven otherwise and then go ahead and handle the uh, the firearm so we've got our v3 stingray holster here from Klinger and it says wash your hands well i just did that uh before i started the video so we won't take the time to go do that clean the holster body with the rubbing alcohol so that is what is in the wipe here just a regular alcohol swab let's make sure we get all foreign matter dust debris most importantly, we want to remove any kind of natural oil from my fingers from the surface of this Kydex so that the adhesive on the Velcro dots 
can stick. All right, then it says to place the dots on the holster body. Let's give that just a chance to uh, dry off for just a little bit. It won't take long for the alcohol to evaporate. So let us now, looks like we're doing pretty good. Let's peel these off of the backer without getting too much oil on them. It says place the dots right on and then apply generous pressure to ensure that they adhere well. Now the nice thing that I like about this is these are the loop side of the Velcro. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and put one right over these holes because I never use my holster in a left-handed configuration. But you may want to think about that if you are ambidextrous or if you want your holster to be ambidextrous. There's not really any picture or instruction on where all we need to install the dots. So we'll put one over here, kind of cover that surface. And then one last dot. Let's just put it here at the top of the trigger guard. Hopefully this will hold our cushion on. Uh, it does also say here on the card that more dots are available. So if you uh, would like to use this on other products, you can uh, just get more dots right from them. And like I said, these are actual Velcro branded dots. So that's very, very nice. We know that these will last just as long as the holster does. So then we're just going to take the, uh, the cushion and just stick that right here onto the holster. Stick that Velcro down so it adheres well to all the dots that we put on. And now we have a Kydex holster from Klinger that is actually padded and cushioned. I always complained that this was the part down here that always dug into me and made it uncomfortable. Actually, I think it was this part back here. So uh, as that sits on the belt, rubs on the bottom, or the bottom of it rather rubs on uh, the side of my leg, side of my hip there, and uh, makes it not always the most comfortable. Now, we can peel this off, we can readjust as we need for the, uh, the positioning. So, like it fits lots of different sized holsters. So that's kind of neat. Uh, this is the only holster that I own right now from, from Klinger, um, for obvious reasons. Knowing that uh, it was not the most comfortable one, I did not plan on ordering any others. Um, so we're gonna test this out now with the Klinger cushion. We've also got a spare Klinger cushion. And they have even said, right, uh, I watched the watched the cool video when they first reached out to me um, on their YouTube channel. And it says you can put this on any Kydex holster. It doesn't have to be theirs. So if you've got a holster that you really like, but it's not the most comfortable or it rubs just in the wrong area, uh, you can check out this product. This is neat. Now I'm going to set that aside for now. We've got the good, strong, um, since these are Velcro branded, I am going to go out on a limb and just guess that probably the hook side is also uh, Velcro branded uh, material. So hopefully it's that's the case. Uh, this is actually padded on the back side. It's got a nice uh, kind of a nylon finish right there. And then this actually feels like felt around the edges. It is edge bound, so it it's not going to rub on you. It's nice and soft. Um, I don't know if I can get that very well in the light so you can kind of see it, but this is this is a nice felt edge, nice and cushy. Of course, it's got their uh, their logo right on it. Um, and it's kind of thick too. So there's a good probably quarter inch of foam in there. So let's, let's give this a whirl. I'm going to uh, put this in my waistband, test it out. 
let you know what I think of it. So uh, it won't be a, a video that you'll see in the next few days or in the next few weeks even. I will give this an honest run for its money. And I wonder if that's upside down. Do you think? Do you think it needs to go like this? That probably makes more sense. That's the best part about Velcro. You can just pop it off, reposition, figure out exactly how it is that uh, you need this to go. Um, I tell you what, I'm I'm excited about trying this now uh, with this holster because it is an excellent product, and uh, I would love to be able to come back and say that Klinger has fixed the only issue that I had with their with their holster. Uh, so we'll let you know what happens here in uh, in the future. So be looking for that video. In the meantime, go check out the original uh, videos that we had on the V3 Stingray holster. We'll put those up uh, right up in this region up in here so that you can uh, find those and click on those as well. Uh, one more time, the Klinger cushion from Klinger holsters sticks right on with some Velcro dots and uh, really makes this look like a nice cushioned product. Now, it, it's it's... Gave it the one thing that it was missing that I preferred um, my Alien Gear over my Clinger. So Alien Gear is probably going to have a run for its money now. <clears throat> so we'll test this out. We'll let you know. Thanks for watching. God bless.